What's up guys and welcome back to another eBay Miniature Rescue. Today we're going to do something a little different and pretty special. The company WarpFireMinis.com contacted me through eBay and asked if I would review their new subscription box for Warhammer and 40k called the Warp Crate. So the idea is you pick the game, both games, Age of Sigmar or 40k. You pick your faction if you want something specific and it's 20 bucks plus shipping. You can get these on their website at warpfireminis.com or through their eBay store. So for 20 bucks plus shipping, not only do you get to pick the game that you want and the faction, but they are guaranteeing that there will be $40 plus in miniatures in each box. So let's open this guy up and see what we have. I should also mention that WarpfireMinis.com does a trade-in program where they will give you 50% of retail value for your old minis. And you can use that towards buying new minis from them. It's a pretty sweet deal and I have gotten some awesome eBay rescues from them. So when they asked me to pick a faction for the box that they were going to send me, you know, I said kind of a mixed bag of a bunch of things, but I mainly use Nurgle stuff. So the first thing I'm pulling out are the old, awesome pewter plague bearers. These things have a ton of character and they go for a pretty large price tag on eBay. So far, I'm pretty happy with what's coming out of this box. So let's grab another bag and we will see what else is in here. All right, so this really kind of took me back a little bit. I'm so happy that there is paint in this box because nothing gets you to use new colors, like just randomly getting paints that you may have never used before. So this was a huge surprise to me and definitely one for the wind column. All right, so I'm gonna reach in and just grab another package and see what we've got. And it's more plague bears, awesome. So we're on our way towards a squad of awesome pewter plague bearers. So reaching in the bag again, I grab another package and it's pretty heavy, feels like the rest of the plague bearers, and they are, and that completes an awesome squad of 10. So the average price for a squad of 10 pewter plague bearers is between 25 and $35. So we're already most of the way there toward that guaranteed 40 bucks. And the last model I pull out is a skink priest, a Seraphon skink priest, and those immediately for this specific plastic model is at least 15 bucks. So with the $4 or $5, depending on where you get it at, paint, this entire collection is 40 plus dollars for sure. So let's summarize a little bit. We know that we got 40 plus dollars in miniatures and paint, which really surprised me and excites me for this subscription box moving forward. The warp crate so far seems like it's going to deliver on that promise of Warhammer minis. I've gotten other Warhammer in quotations subscription boxes before and picked a faction and done the things and they sent me not Warhammer minis like a few months in a row and so I just canceled it. So these guys seem to have what everyone else is lacking and they're US based, which for me makes a 
big difference because those other subscription boxes weren't. And that was huge on the shipping. Basically, these boxes from Warpfire Minis are $20 plus shipping. So that's $23 from their website directly and $25 from eBay. That's pretty incredible. And the value seems to be there. So I just wanted to say thank you to Warpfire Minis for sending me this box. It was a pleasure to open for you. And for everyone else, thank you for joining me on another eBay Miniature Rescue. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Check out our Facebook page. That's facebook.com slash eBay Miniature Rescues, where you can post your works in progress, share photos, talk about rescues, or just painting in general. And I will see you in the next video.